2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Boy, you can feel that special playoff energy as we wrap up the starting lineups. So sit tight. We'll be right back after this. Welcome to the NBA Finals. One question on everyone's mind. Will this be the night an NBA champion is crowned? Game 5. It's right here on 2K Sports. Hi everyone. Alongside Grant Hill and Steve Smith. I'm Brian Anderson. We'll hear from Allie LaForce in just a moment. Allie, it's all yours. Thanks, Brian. Well, current financial challenges have Commissioner Silver and the league office dusting off proposals for expansion. Silver said at some point, it's manifest destiny that the league will eventually expand. The last time that happened was 1988 with the Bobcats. Guys, Seattle fans hopeful things move along. Boy, Allie, wouldn't that be something? Now the opening lineup for the Los Angeles Clippers. At small forward, Kawhi and Batum. Jackson and George, they're manning the backcourt. And it's Zubats in at the five, roaming the paint. And for Philadelphia, Harris and Embiid, the big men inside. Curry and Green, the two and the three. And it's Simmons in at the point guard position. Taking a look at Los Angeles, they've been outmatched so far in this series. And certainly at this point, the odds are stacked against them. But there are 28 other teams who'd love to still be playing at this point. So enjoy the moment, play your hardest, and let the chips fall where they may. So Philadelphia will get the first possession. Pass to Embiid. And Embiid gets the double team. Outside Simmons. Here's Curry. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. Terrific playmaking from Simmons. Getting the ball into his hands off a wide open shooter. George passes to Zubac. Kicks it out to Jackson. Pass to Zubac. Six on the shot clock. Back to George. Puts up a three. It's hauled in by the Sixers. About a minute into this first quarter. Harris passes to Simmons. Inside, Embiid. Yes! And that's Simmons with the assist. Yeah, the playmaking skills of Simmons are elite. The pass-first attitude he brings is what helps tie the team together. To the paint. Leonard gets the bucket. Oh, and setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. To the left wing. Embiid passes to Green. Great D that time from Zubats. Ooh, old school right there. No easy buckets. Leonard against Embiid. Here's George. Jackson outside. Out of bounds. It'll be Philadelphia's ball. And real quick, let's check out the field goal percentage leaders in the postseason. Fourth, Ivica Zubats, and of course Ben Simmons. They've been both taking great shots. That's the efficiency you want in the postseason. The 76ers have gone two of three to get this one going. Simmons is doubled. Can't connect from short range. For Los Angeles, they've gone one of three from the floor. George passes to Jackson. Chance there to take the lead, but a miss. Not the efficient start they were hoping for. Only one for four from the field. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Leonard. An outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block. Yeah, this is the elevated energy level you expect in the postseason. Chasing down blocks and making an impact.
And he lobs it up, and Embiid throws it down. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Here's Jackson. Hey, it's blocked by Simmons. Oh, what a swap by Simmons. Using his size and reach to bat away the shot. Banked it in off the glass. If you give him any sort of space, he's going to attack. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Curry finds Simmons. Now here's Embiid. Leonard defending. Embiid. Good. Embiid's got six. The D hasn't been quick enough to react to the ball inside. That's helped cause this run. Timeout called. The Clippers. It's time to talk this over and try to put a stop to this run. Because right now, it feels like the pace is being dictated to them. They need to go back to playing their brand of basketball. Just under three and a half minutes played. Here's Leonard. Doesn't go for him. Green with the defensive effort. Here's Philadelphia. They're on a 10-2 run here. And then Embiid with the dunk. What a way to begin this game. Dominating at both ends of the floor. They came in prepared, focused, and really jumped on the other team early. Now here's George. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Jackson outside. And Embiid with the block. A menace on the defensive end. Embiid's reach disrupts your offense. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside. For 3, George hits a 3-pointer. Oh, Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. The Sixers leading. Outside Simmons. to Embiid. Again gets it to go. He can't miss. Five for five. And why go away from attacking inside if the D has no answer for you? Green against Leonard. It's stolen by Green. Fast break, Philadelphia. Here's Curry. Rejected by George. Not going to be Paul George with that move. He's too long and too talented of a defender. Simmons up top, defended by Jackson. Simmons, the pass to Embiid. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. His play is a big reason why they're ahead. He hasn't missed a shot all night. Joel and Green. Free throw drops for Embiid. A fun-loving player on and off the court. Embiid continues to get better. One of the league's top big men. 
George passes to Zubats. Down low. Here's Leonard. Rebounded by Green. Hmm, I'm not sure what happened on that play. They have relaxed a little bit once he got to the rim. And early on, they've been on a tear. Just getting whatever they want offensively. They established the pace. They made shots. This is why they're way out in front. Here's Jackson following the score by Philadelphia. Driving inside. Oh, great D that time from Harris. This has been a tough quarter for him and a challenging game for this team. Here's Curry. Paul George pulls down the board. And he's frustrated. That's a shot he can make in his sleep. Jackson outside. Leonard on the wing. Over Harris. And it's good. Off the back rim and in. Leonard's got his second basket. Masterful execution. Kawhi just has a sense for when to shoot the mid-range. To the paint. Here's Embiid. It's good. And a beautiful setup from Simmons that time. Embiid's got 15. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Time called here. The Clippers decide to talk it over. Well, you look at Joel Embiid. He's playing really well right now. The man has been relentless scoring inside, attacking the rim every chance he gets. Their defense has been powerless to stop him. We'll see what adjustments they make coming out of this timeout. Drummond is checked in for the Sixers. And the Clippers making a change here as well. Ibaka, he's checked in for Zubats. Los Angeles has gone one for three from outside so far in this game. Knocked loose. It's stolen by Green. And rejected. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Knocks it loose. It's stolen by Green. Pass to Curry. The shot won't fall. And Los Angeles the other way now. And they bump this quarter. He's trying to shoot his way out of it. Here's Leonard. Doesn't go that time. Green with the defensive effort. And he's going for the lob. And the jam by Drummond. I mean, tremendous body control in the air. Andre with the easy catch and flush. Leonard with the ball. And Drummond picks him up defensively. Shot by Leonard. No good. The 76ers shooting a terrific 58% to start the game. Excellent numbers. Out to Harris. Good work defensively by Leonard. And for Los Angeles, they're shooting just 21% in the first quarter. Pass to Jackson. Leonard against Simmons. Drummond grabs the miss. I can see he's pressing a little now, trying desperately to help them shrink this deficit. Here's George. And again, it's the Clippers missing. George has gone one for three from the field here. Here's Harris. And it's blocked by Ibaka. Great defense by Serge. A tremendous athlete. Blessed with insane length and leaping ability. And the 76ers will have a different look here. Niang, he's checked in for Harris. Thibel comes in for Green. Milton's checked in for Curry. And it's Maxi in for Simmons.
Now here's Milton. Tight defense on him. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. They've controlled the paint so far. That's been the difference. I'll tell you, this was their strategy coming in. They obviously identified a weakness there inside. Kennard can't get it to go. Here's Maxi. Count it. One for one to start the game. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Back to Rondo. Six to shoot. It's stolen by Drummond. To the middle. A nice shot by Milton. Milton's gotten his second bucket. All right, let's take a look at the energy stats. How the hustle game has been going for the 76ers. Their aggressiveness on D has been the most glaring aspect of this game so far. They have the heat turned all the way up in this first half. And another area where they've been on point is defending the rim. A lot of blocks through the first two quarters. And Philadelphia has possession. The Clippers getting their last shot to go. Here's Maxi. He's in his comfort zone. Two for two to start this one. And this is what you want to do when you've got a big lead. Must stay aggressive. I'm impressed with their intensity tonight. They have came in focused and they've executed. Fires from 14. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Drummond's got his fifth rebound in this one. Throws it up high. And Drummond with the jam. Oh, great teamwork right there. Yeah, you got to love the finish. Bringing it down with some attitude. Pass to Ibaka. Kennard outside. Here's Mann. Clock at six. Let's it fly. That one a little long. Already plus five in terms of rebound margin. Here's Thibault. Boom! He jams it straight down. And taking a look at this first half, they've just shown better shot selection. What they have done is ran their plays all the way through until they get something they like. Now here's Rondo. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. And a nice finish on the layup. Something that's really evolved for Ibaka. The ability to absorb contact while maintaining control. Milton against Kennard. Inside. Drummond. Count the bucket. Coming off a perfectly placed pass. Drummond's got six. Man, that's now ten straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense, man. Nice shot by Kennard. Rondo is out there to distribute the ball. He is a master at finding the open man. Kennard against Milton. Shot clock at six. Let's it fly. Can't nail the jumper. And that's it for the first quarter in what has been a very lopsided game. Sixers ahead, running away with it. And the second quarter is on its way when we return. this pivotal game five or oh, the 76ers at the top of their game huh well a big differentiator was their ability to generate offense by pounding the glass and you know this most of the time offensive rebounds generate high percentage looks and for los angeles they're shooting a very low 27 percent so far in this one matisse thibel out there with george niang then there's Tyrese Maxey, then it's Andre Drummond, and it's Milton in at the two. That's the group for Philadelphia to kick off the second quarter. And they're plus five on the boys after that rebound. 
Outside Tybel. Clock at six. Pass to Nia. Late clock. The Sixers need to put one up here. The turnaround, Jay. The shot by Drummond. No good. Now Los Angeles with it. Beverly outside. To the inside. Ibaka. Ooh, the lead pass was in the perfect spot to set up the layup. Ibaka's got his second basket of the game. And the 76ers shooting has been great this game. 58%. Pass to Maxi. The three is up. They get the rebound. Launches a three. Rebounded by Winslow. Over Tybal. And it's Winslow missing. I don't know if you can credit the defense for that. It was just a missed opportunity. Ibaka with a steal. On the attack, Winslow. Rebound by the 76ers. Drummond's got rebound number eight now. Outside Milton to the middle. Maxi, that's good. Maxi's got six. Like a matador. Ole! There was no defense. That has to be one of the easier shots I've seen tonight. And this is what happens when you start to break your opponent's spirit. The resistance is no longer there. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Tremendous individual play. I mean, challenging the heart of that defense. Drummond against Ibaka. Pass to Nia. Here's Maxi. Fires for three. Gets the three to fall. He's got nine. Terrific play. This is why you run your offense through him and live with the results. And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second. Oh, Drummond with the block. I feel like Drummond saw that one coming all the way. Great anticipation. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. Jake Milton. Shooting two. First one falls for him. Both shots good from the strike. Now here's George. And here in the second quarter, about three minutes played. Joel a consummate Andy. team player. Paul George is an excellent leader, and he's cool to let others lead Shooting also. For LA, Paul George. And he drops the first. Ben Simmons is checked in for Milton. George hits them both. Now, for those joining us now, we're in the second quarter, about three minutes gone by. Outside Simmons. It's hauled in by the Clippers. Beverly outside. Pass to George. Back to Beverly. Now here's Leonard. 
pulls it in. The 76ers have gotten just two of six field goals to go in the second. Perfect pass to set up the lay-in. Embiid's got 17 points. You know Embiid loves to produce like this, and you can tell it's firing up the team as well. Here's George. Nice. Gets his second bucket. He's two for four now. The 76ers have gone three for seven here in the second quarter. Simmons, the pass to Embiid. Here's Springer. Outside Simmons. Pass to Korkmaz. Four on the clock. And Kawhi Leonard gets a whistle that time. Kawhi Leonard. That's his first foul of the game. And the Clippers making a change here. Jackson is checked in. And so here is Philadelphia. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. And the moment MB gets the ball anywhere near the hoop, it's over. Too strong to stop without foul. Shooting two. The free throw drops for Embiid. And Embiid drops them both. Yeah, they, they're really cashing in more at the line here in the second quarter. Jackson outside. Now George. He's got seven. Down low. Here's Zubats. And it's slammed in by Zubats. Paul, well, Paul knows the defense is locked in on him, so he takes advantage and finds the open man. Jackson against Simmons. Here's Springer. Off target with the three. For Los Angeles, they've gotten four of their first nine shots to go here in the second. Pass to George. Leonard outside. Looking to get it going. Kicks it to George. Boy, he clanks that one off the oh, back George. iron and it falls. George has got six here in the corner. He doesn't need much time to get his shot off. Paul George is a dependable catch and shoot option. Here's Embiid. He's guarded by Zubats. Rebound by the Clippers. Zubats has got four rebounds in the game. George outside. Oh, stolen by Embiid. Pass to Reed. Batum pulls it in. Batum's got five rebounds in the game. Picked his pocket. Here's Korkmaz. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. It's going to go on Kawhi Leonard. And he makes a first. And good on the second, so he makes them both. So it's the Clippers now. Jackson with it. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Here's George. Offensive board. Zubats. 
Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Shooting for L.A., Ibiza Zubac. Free throw drops from Zubats. Both good from the line that time. And they seem to have taken a more heads-on approach this quarter. <laughs> and it's getting them to the free throw line. Simmons against Zubats. Oh, nice touch on the hook shot. Simmons has gotten his third basket of the night. So few players still use the hook shot, but it's a tremendous weapon when done right. Harris against Jackson. Pass to George. Leonard outside. Just five on the clock. Unloads from 13. Here's Zubats. Excellent D there from MB. Philadelphia's gone just one of four from downtown so far in the second. Harris misses. I know he's on a cold streak, but he can't let that get in his head. And his rhythm, it's been way off. The goal now might be to get him something easy at the rim so he can just see the ball go in through the net, and that helps. Jackson can't get it to go. There is the value of great rim protection without fouling, forcing the miss. Curry against George. And a foul LA called on the way up. Paul so he'll George. take two from the free throw line. It's going to go on Paul George. Seth Curry. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. The 76ers making a switch here. Green is checked in. And the Clippers will go for a different look here. Ibaka, he's checked in for Zubats. Kennard comes in for Batum. Johnson, he's checked in for George. And it's Rondo in for Jackson. And so Curry nails both of them. And here's Rondo. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Pass to Ibaka. Now Kennard. Up top, Rondo. Four on the clock. Here's Johnson. Misses off the right iron. Well, the 76ers shooting 52% from the floor so far. Simmons with it. Defended by Kennard. Pass to Green. Fires the three. He can't get it to go. And the Clippers will come the other way. Johnson inside. He's covered by Curry. Kennard outside. Outside. Rondo. Poked away. Embiid with it. And Kennard picks him up defensively. Simmons against Kennard. Simmons, the pass to Embiid. Outside for Green. Harris outside. Five on the clock. Kennard against Simmons. Rebounded by Rondo. And their biggest problem so far, taking care of the ball. Yeah, they made some great plays, but way too many turnovers. Inside. 
Ibaka, good. Ibaka's got four points now in the quarter. This is the kind of physical play we saw from Ibaka earlier in his career. We're seeing it again now. To the paint. Here's Embiid. It's good. And a beautiful setup from Simmons that time. Simmons has got eight assists here tonight. Leonard against Embiid. And the shot no good. A bit short. They keep following his number, which is partly how they've dug this hole. Down low. Here's Harris. No good with a layup. Can you believe it? He's missed every shot he's taken. Yet this team still continues to hold the lead. Outside. Rondo. Inside, Ibaka. And the jam by Ibaka. Really like watching Rondo go to work in the screen and roll. A genius who can thread the needle. Outside, Simmons. And then B throws it down. B.A., the one-hand dunk just looks so fluid. Yeah, absolutely. Even smooth when he's powering at home like that. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Coach definitely wants to talk about their interior defense, which has not been impressive. It's a matter of want to. Helping out contesting shots. You have to want to make the effort. The 76ers with some changes. Andre Drummond is checked in for Joel Embiid. Thibel comes in for Green. And it's Maxi in for Ben Simmons. Now here's Rondo. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. Hounded by Harris. Drummond grabs the miss. Philadelphia has gone only one of five from beyond the three-point line in the second quarter. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. And for his offense, this has just been a brutal period. Pass to Ibaka. One twenty-one left in the first half. Here's Van. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. The 76ers shooting just 32% here in the second. To the inside. And the jam by Drummond. Just flawless timing right there. Right? The dish, the catch, the flush. The whole thing was perfect. Here we go. The Sixers on the break. Here's Thibault. And the big dunk at the end of the break. They're really in control on both ends of the floor right now. Forcing turnovers and finding easy points. While the other guys struggle to keep up. Now here's Ibaka. Give him eight. You see Surge in the painted area. Feels the defender. Goes on the attack. Shooting for L.A. Serge Ibaka. Two. Two. First free throw is good. Oh, from the Republic of Congo, Serge Ibaka, Dikembe Mutombo, and Biz Magbiambo. A lot of big man talent. Niang, he's checked in for the Sixers. Milton comes in for Curry. Wenslow's checked in for the Clippers. Beverly comes in for Rondo. Second free throw, no good. And it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. And it's Maxi missing. 
The Clippers shooting just 32% here in the second. 30 seconds left in the first half. Winslow. And it's blocked by Thibault. Pass to Milton. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. They're punishing those late defensive rotations. Getting good looks inside throughout the half. Shake Milton. One shot. Clippers, they're shooting a rough 29% for the field here. The turnaround jumper, count it. He has six. Some defenses are designed to yield the mid-range shot. For him, that's a good look. And so a pretty lopsided game through the first half. The Sixers on top, opening up a huge gap. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Well, thank you, guys. Doc Rivers here with us now. Coach, you're ahead at the half. What was the difference? We got stops. We were out running a little bit. Uh, and then we had great spacing against the zone. You know, listen, we started making shots. That always happens. It sure does. Thanks, Coach. Thanks very much, Allie. We'll be back soon to start the second half of basketball. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Taking a look at the 76ers, the confidence they've shown throughout this NBA Finals has continued with their outstanding first half performance tonight. They're playing like they can feel that the championship is only one half away from being theirs. And from what we saw so far from the Sixers, Kenny, what's your takeaway? Well, they built this lead in large part because of the sharpshooters off the bench. The subs played a superb game. Get it? Sub, superb. <laughs> I mean, they played like starters. And over to Shaq. Now your take on the Clippers. I know it's not the case, but it seemed like they were lacking on the offensive game plan. Maybe some guys were improvising when they should have been making the next pass, but hey, not looking good out there. Finals continue here on 2K Sports. What else can you say? Joel Embiid, an impressive effort here today. When he got good position and they got the ball to him, he was automatic. I have to credit them for their patience offensively. They understood the matchup and they took the necessary time to exploit it. And after a very lopsided first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly in the second. Checking out the group for Ty Lu to start the second half. A one-two punch of George and Kawhi on the perimeter. It's All Batum two. at the power forward with Zubats at center. And it's Jackson in at the one spot. Curry passes to Simmons. To the middle. Here's Embiid. It's good. And a beautiful setup from Simmons that time. Simmons has got assist number 10 tonight with that last one. Now here's Jackson. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Excellent D there from Embiid. He liked to have that one back. That's easy money. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. It's been a dominant Boy, night for him. Staying productive throughout. Joel MP. Shooting one. Oh. 
The free throw drops for Embiid. Here's Leonard. And a minute played as the second half gets going. It's not going to go for him. Green with the defensive effort. Pass to Curry. Takes a three. No good that time. And Los Angeles the other way now. Leonard outside. And here's George. He's covered by Curry. Leonard for three. The rebound by Ben Simmons. Simmons has got his seventh rebound here tonight. Only one for four in this half. Sometimes it's execution. Sometimes the shots just don't go down. George passes to Jackson. And here's Zubats. Back to Jackson. Green against George. Over Green. And the Clippers miss again. Very cold start to the second half. One for five. Looking for some continuity. Got a piece of it. And out of bounds. The 76ers will take it. And now another look at that mobile one block defensive performance. Yeah, this is the elevated energy level you expect in the postseason. Chasing down blocks and making an impact. Philadelphia has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Simmons, the pass to Green. Just under two and a half minutes into this third quarter now. Fires in the triple. Green's got himself going with a triple. His first basket of the game. I love the elevation Danny Green gets on his jumper. Makes him tough to defend from distance. Back to Leonard. It's George on the wing. Looking to end the drought. Yes. And it's Leonard with the assist that time. Leonard's got three assists in the game. In full-on catch-up mode. They're raining threes right now. Here's Embiid. And the layup is good off the glass. Embiid's got seven now in this quarter. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Jackson finds Zubats. Down low. Here's George. Oh, great D that time from Harris. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. Inside. It's rebounded by Zubats. Zubats has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. George for three. That doesn't go either for George. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. And then Embiid with the dunk. This is where Tobias has really improved, keeping his eyes up and making plays for others. Now here's Leonard. Pass to Jackson. Knocked loose. Fast break, Philadelphia. Here's Simmons. Oh, and the jam by Simmons. I mean, one of the best defenders in the league. Simmons creates offense for himself thanks to his efforts on defense. And we just got a second look there at an exceptional mobile one block. Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. Here's Jackson. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. The three, George. And Reed pulls it down. And here are the 76ers. They're on a 14-3 run. Harris, count that bucket. And what's working here? Each guy is willing to make the next pass. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from here for the 76ers. I mean, a fantastic game for them in open court. Their fast break points really stand out. Another thing, they've not only caused a bunch of turnovers tonight, they've turned most of them into points. And that one misses. 
for a player this good, still in his 20s, Tobias Harris has been on an astonishing number of teams. Jackson can't get it to go. He's still looking for his first bucket. You can't put all their struggles on him tonight, but he's been brutal. And in the second half here, they're shooting a terrific percentage from three. Los Angeles has gone two of six from downtown here in the second half. Jackson outside. Leonard against Simmons. Looking to get back on track. And it's laid up Leonard. and in by Leonard. Leonard's got six points. What strength from the seasoned veteran. Leonard loves going at defenders and scoring on them. Here's Harris. The Clippers grab the miss. Zubac has got rebound number eight now. He really can't buy a bucket, but his teammates have his back. George passes to Leonard. George with it. Beyond the arc. That basket is good. Oh, Off the assist from Jackson. George has got nine points here in the second half. The 76ers have gone 8 of 12 from the floor in the third quarter. Here's Harris. Second chance effort. Count that one. Reed. <laughs> They're just taking what the defense gives them. And right now, that's the interior. Simmons against Jackson. And there's the lob. Oh, deflected. Out of bounds as Los Angeles keeps possession. Almost had the steal. You have to love the pressure defense. Fantastic anticipation. He has active hands. Even though he doesn't come away with the turnover, he's disrupting their offensive flow. Drummond's checked in for the Sixers. Maxi comes in for Simmons. And the Clippers making a change here as well. Oh, Johnson's checked in. Can't blame the deficit on him. He's been scoring at will this period. Here's Springer, covered by Johnson. Here's Springer. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. And the jam by Drummond. That gives him a double-double in this one. It was contact there, but that's not enough to stop Andre Drummond. Now here's Leonard. He's got six. Into the lane. Good on the shot. Why Leonard? Leonard's got eight points. Philadelphia has gotten two of four threes to fall here in this third quarter. Pass to Drummond. Shoots over Zubac. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It's going to go on Paul George. Hard not to bite on Drummond's pump fake. You have to get up quick to have any chance to contest his shot. That one misses. A nightly double-double machine. Andre Drummond gives you reliable production. And the Clippers will go for a different look here. And he misses the second one as well, so 0 for 2 that time. The Clippers have gotten 6 of 14 shots to drop in this third quarter. Outside, Rondo. Shot clock at 5. Korkmaz pulls it in. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they rebounded the ball tremendously well. And so it looks like it'll be Philadelphia ball. Nie, he's checked in for the Sixers. Here's Milton. Rebound by the Clippers. Ibaka's got six rebounds now in the game. Outside, Rondo. Driving in. 
And it's all from three-point range. Given his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that open. Milton against Johnson. Milton passes to Drummond. Rebounded by Johnson. And for Los Angeles, they're shooting just around 32% from the field. Oh, Drummond with a block! Johnson against Milton. Pass to Maxi. Can't get it to drop. And Los Angeles the other way now. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Philadelphia has gone two for five from three since halftime. Left side, Thibel. Now Drummond, covered by Johnson. Tries to snap the cold streak. And the layup is good by Drummond. Drummond's got four points in the quarter. What well, makes Drummond a great rebounder, not just the size and athleticism, it's his tremendous anticipation. Now here's Rondo. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. And Andre Drummond Andre is going to pick up the foul. That's foul number two for him. Beverly, he's checked in for the Clippers. So it's the Clippers now. And the ball is tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. And so here is Philadelphia. The 76ers shooting at about 51% for the game so far on this one. Here's Maxi. He's got nine. Plays it up and in on a nice reverse. Maxie's got 11 points. They're winning the battle down low by imposing their will. Here's Mann. Over to the wing. Beverly against Drummond. Pass to Ibaka. It's hauled in by the Sixers. Oh, there's the alley! And Drummond with the jam! They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. You love it. This has been an impressive performance tonight. Even with a big lead, they've maintained their focus. And Andre Drummond Andre is going to pick Drummond. up the foul. That's his third foul of the game. Wenslow's checked in for Rondo. to man. 4-3. The rebound by Maxi. Philadelphia has gone two for five from three since halftime. Drummond controls the rebound and the putback. Drummond's got eight points here in the quarter. He's hot this quarter, getting the shots he wants, and he's delivering. Outside Winslow. To the paint. Ibaka's shot is off. How about the unselfishness of this team? <laughs> yeah, the willingness to make the next pass has this defense scrambled. The Clippers shooting a rough 29% from the field here. Beverly outside to stop the run. Oh, rejected by Drummond. Now here's Thibel. Outside Milton. There's the drive. And counted. Now five for seven. Here's Beverly. 36 seconds left in the third quarter. Oh, Drummond with the block. And he gets it back. Six on the shot clock. Here's Mann. Drummond defending. Thibel shoots from 12 misses off the left iron here's man 
Here's Ibaka. He blocks it again. A defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. Joel Embiid. He's feeling it tonight and has been the driving force for the Philadelphia 76ers. He's been an offensive force. Now with over 30 points after the quarter. We'll be back in a moment. And now we have a moment to reveal our State Farm assist of the game. We talk about painting a magnificent picture with that, Don. Just a great decision and a perfect delivery. Execution. This is what you practice every day. These guys are professionals. Beautiful play. And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may already be out of hand. We've got George Niang, Shake Milton out there with Tyrese Maxey. Then it's Matisse Thibel, and it's Reed in at center, filling out the middle. That's the group in the game for the 76ers. And here are the Clippers now. Kennard outside. Pass to Ibaka. Shoots over Maxi. Wow, way off on that one. Well, the 76ers shooting has been good. Around 52% from the field. Here's Reed. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Beverly with it. Kicks it out to Kennard. All sorts of time, and he hits the jumper. Always working to find open territory. Kennard's lethal in catch and shoot. Outside Milton. A few possessions into the fourth. Just over a minute play. That shot is off. Los Angeles shooting just 28%. Lacking confidence on offense right now. And here's Beverly. The three ball. Philadelphia grabs the miss. Oh, man. He hasn't had the rhythm tonight. Tried to make up for it there, but it just wasn't meant to be. Here's Maxi. Buckets. He's now 6 of 10 from the field. They have no answer defensively inside. For Los Angeles, they've gotten just one shot to fall out of three attempts in the fourth. Kennard outside. Pass to Ibaka. Shot on the wing. Rebound by the 76ers. Bible's got four rebounds in the game. Now here's Milton. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. The officials were right on top of that one. Shake Milton. First one falls. Both teams deciding to change it up. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Just under two and a half minutes gone by now in the final quarter. Here's Zubats. And he's going to the line oh, for two. Ooh. The official saw contact while he was going up. Shooting for LA, Ibiza Zubats. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Thank you. 
He misses the free throw. Embiid, he's checked in for Milton. And the second free throw is good. The 76ers have gotten half of their attempts to fall in the fourth. Two for four now. Here's Springer, defended by Jackson. Pass to Embiid. Six to shoot. Here's Reed. He shoots a three. And they force the shot clock violation. Great D. The Clippers have gone one of four since the fourth quarter began. Fourth quarter keeps moving along. Three minutes gone by now. No luck on that one. So Philadelphia will take it the other way. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. Poke loose. It's stolen by Leonard. And it's the Clippers on the break. Pass to Jackson. Cashes in the 12-footer. Breakdown by the defense there. Jackson, a solid mid-range shooter. You like to push him out further. Quarter of play and over three and a half minutes have gone by now. The steal. In transition, here come the Clippers. From behind the arc. Knocks down the long J. Jackson. Jackson's got five points now in the quarter. You know, a little inconsistent from deep when he first entered the league. Jackson now an emerging three-point threat. Tipped away. Here's Batum. Now here's Leonard. Jackson outside. Back to Leonard. Six on the shot clock. Takes a 13-footer. That one off the back iron and out. They are blowing this one open. Maybe the only question is how big will this lead grow? Korkmaz. Good. I love it. Beautiful job getting to the rim. Making a play. Now Jackson. Leonard outside. From deep. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Leonard. For Philadelphia, they've got three of six shots to go in this fourth quarter. Pass to Nia. Over Jackson. Niang, no good. It can be tough to find space in the mid-range area. Probably should have passed that one up. Jackson finds Leonard. Can't hit that one. Wow. Now that's having a highlight reel in your mind. But in reality, it didn't work. To the inside. Embiid. And Embiid throws it down. An emphatic slam by Embiid. Not afraid to get physical with the defense. And there's the foul. It's on Joel Embiid. That'll be a second foul of the game. Leonard on the wing. And with each miss, you can see the frustration yeah, mounting from these. Powerful board, complete player. That's why Leonard's getting paid Shooting max. For LA, Kawhi Leonard. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. The free throw drops for Leonard. 
an offensive juggernaut and aggressive defender. Kawhi is just the total package, in my opinion. Brings a winning mindset as well. Offensive rebound. Here's Korkmaz. No good with the triple. Los Angeles has gotten one of three to fall from downtown here in the fourth. Leonard for three. Again, the miss by Leonard for Philadelphia. They've gone four for ten in the fourth. Pass to Embiid. And then Embiid with the dunk. He can do incredible things. He can also help you win by simply being reliable. Embiid against Leonard. Shoots over Embiid. They get the rebound. And they're ahead right now because they're working so hard on the glass. You know, you look at how they built this lead. It's been through extra possessions. Mm -hmm. Now here's Jackson. George outside. Jackson with it. Leonard outside. Again, the miss by Leonard. You know, we talk a lot about scoring efficiency. He's displaying the exact opposite. Down low. Here's Embiid. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Embiid's got 38 points. The control and focus from Embiid. Able to absorb hits from the defense and still finish. Here's Leonard. And that one comes up a bit short. Something's off about him this quarter. And it also shows you how difficult this game is. He's just a little bit off, but it can result in missing everything. Here's Reed. And Kawhi Leonard gets a whistle that time. Kawhi Leonard. That'll get him his fourth foul of the game. And with plenty of time left, that's his fourth foul. He needs to stay cognizant of that moving forward. Here's Springer. With the drive. Tremendous defense. Reggie has the quickness to stay on the ball and the long reach to affect the shot. The Clippers shooting only 27% for today's game. George passes to Leonard. Pass to Jackson. Inside. From 12 feet. Zubac's shot is off. For Philadelphia, they've gone just 6 of 14 in this final quarter. To the left side wing. Here's Niang. Here's Korkmaz. Now Embiid. Just 5 to shoot. Back to Korkmaz. Leonard pulls down the board. Leonard's got rebound number 8 here already in the game. And Jackson, here we go. Yes, and it's Leonard with the assist that time. Leonard's got four assists in the game. After a lackluster first half, he's taken charge offensively. We'll see how the defense responds. MB drawing the double team. Here's Niang. No good from outside. This is the shot they wanted to get. Right guy, right spot, wrong result. Leonard outside. Pass to Zubats. Kicks it to George. Off target from three-point range. Philadelphia's got nothing to fall from outside the arc here in the fourth. 0 for 4. Out to the wing. Here's Niang. Back to Embiid. Shoots over Zubats. The rebound by Jackson. Los Angeles has got just one of six threes to go in the fourth. Oh, and the jam by George. Oh, Capable of flat out torching you. Once PG-13 gets into a groove, watch out. Pass to Embiid. Lays it up and banks it in. Embiid's got 40 points. He's really finding his rhythm here. I mean, it's a smart move to keep feeding him the ball. Let him decide whether to shoot it, whether to pass it. He's your catalyst right now. The 76 are shooting right below 40% here in the fourth. 149 left in the fourth quarter. Reed. It's rebounded by Zubats. 
Zubox has got the glass covered here tonight. That's 11 boards for him. Here's Leonard. Rebound by the 76ers. Embiid's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Pass to Niang. Tipped. That's going to do it for this game. These teams, the entire season. What an unbelievable journey. It'll be a hoisting of the Larry O'Brien for the 76ers. And it was a big-time performance across the board. They looked like they were having fun out there, Grant. Yeah, B.A., it was almost like watching a cat play with a mouse. I mean, they did pretty much anything they wanted to do out there today. And the goal they've been working toward all season is almost here. A chance to lift the trophy thanks to a fantastic Game 5 performance. What a great way to cap it off. Taking care of business and making sure there wasn't going to be any miracle comeback. This is a team that knows how to close. And when you look at the game, the one thing that helped fuel this team to victory was the efficiency for Joel Embiid. Hard not to be impressed by what he did tonight. He was aggressive, he was efficient, and the defense had no answer. Double team on Leonard. There's Jackson with the three. Yes, and it's Leonard with the assist that time. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. Look smart when the shots are going down. Here's Springer, defended by Jackson. And they've done it! The Philadelphia 76ers have won the NBA championship. Well, they did it. And as they celebrate, you can just see the relief, the exhilaration that comes from winning it all. An incredible display of resilience. Seemingly, every time they were challenged, Grant, they rose to the occasion. And B.A., I have to give props to the front office for making all the right moves. And the coaching, just phenomenal. And then, hey, it's a player's lead. Those guys came out and took care of business. And thanks to everyone out there who's been with us through this entire journey. Take care, and we'll see you next season.